Hi friends how are you? After watching this video, you will be able to fit up a 90 degree elbow to an existing spool in any degree rotation. Please subscribe and comment. The formula and the calculation example are given at the end of the video. For the demonstration, I will show you how to fit up the elbow, 45 degree rotated. Choose a leveled plate or a platform. Put the elbow on the plate and make it level. Hold a level bottle at its side vertically and firmly. Measure the diameter. Mark half diameter on the top of the elbow. Now, hold the level bottle on the opposite side and cross check the center. Mark this line as zero. Check the circumference of the elbow at one end. Because the rotation is 45 degree, divide the circumference into eight equal parts. Since the diameter of the elbow is 406 millimeters, one eighth part is 159 millimeters. Mark this measurement anti-clockwise on the elbow as shown and label it as 45 degree. Now go to the existing spool, check the level and correct it. Mark the zero degree. Put the pipe clamp on the pipe. If you don't have one, watch my previous videos for how to make a pipe clamp. Put the elbow on the pipe clamp. Make sure the marked end is near to the pipe. Arrange proper supports below the elbow. Put the gap rod in the joint. Now slowly rotate the elbow until the 45 degree mark comes opposite to the zero mark on the pipe. Make the joint gap equal all around the joint. Tack weld at the four quarters of the joint. I hope this video was helpful to you. Thank you for watching. Now, see the formula and calculations for finding the arc length of any degree rotation with example. Arc length of any degree. Circumference of the pipe divided by 360 into the degree of rotation. Let us check the arc length of 12 inch pipe rotated 30 degree. Apply the formula. The answer is 84.8 millimeters.